What's good, YouTube? It's your boy Bugs back, and yes, today, guys, I'm gonna be, I'm be going to Albany very soon. I'm gonna go party and stuff over there, so I'm gonna be gone for Friday, Saturday, and Sunday. And all these, re all these videos I'm posting Friday, Saturday, Sunday are gonna be pre-recorded and ready for you guys because I'm grinding. Yes, I'm grinding so hard for you guys. I'm gonna post mad budget videos. I know you guys love the budget cards. I know a lot of people can't afford stubs. So, I'm posting all these videos about budget cars and whatnot. So, guys, I hope you guys enjoy all the budget videos. I know, I know, actually, my most viewed videos are budget card videos. So, I'm going to keep going. It doesn't look like anyone's posting about budget cards. So, I'm going to keep posting about it. So, all right. Let's get into it, guys. We're going to go for this video. Budget right fielders. Okay, guys? Budget right fielders. Okay? So, we're going to go. We got... I'm gonna go down here. Okay. Oh wait, wait. Where's that Babe Ruth? Where did I see? I. Yo. <laughs> guys. Okay. Number one on the list. Oh my goodness. Yes, guys. Babe Ruth and Daddy. Holy crap! I'm about to pick him up. So guys, look at this card. I'm I'm shocked. This guy is gonna just hit nukes every single time. So right here. For that price, complete the one of the best budget cards in the game. Period. Like, look at the power. The vision's there. The contact's there. The speed and feeling's not the best. But, like, who cares about fielding, guys? Really? Who cares? It's Babe Ruth the GOAT. So, budget outfielder number one. My favorite one, Babe Ruth Daddy. All right. We got, oh, yes. Another one. Hold up. No, no. My second. Oh, freaking Tani, guys. His batting stance, I guys, I promise you, I use him all the time in Conquest. His batting stance is unbelievable. Like, his batting stance is beautiful. Like, it's the classic lefty batting stance. It's nice and back, yo. His legs are back, yo. It's, oh, my God. His batting stance is beautiful. His vision is beautiful. He Everything about this card is just beautiful. And he's a rookie. He's, I just love this guy in general. He's the GOAT. He's good at fan. He's probably about to break out in fantasy this year. But against righties, I, I, I put him up. I pitch hit him a lot against a righty. And it literally is. I've never not missed a double or a home run in all my bats with him. So second card, Otani by far. Third card, Puig. 1K for Puig. I'm a... I like... Okay, I don't know if you guys remember, but about what six years ago when Puig or five years ago when Puig came into the league, he was like, they're like, yo, the Dodgers are pulling up this guy, Yasiel Puig. This guy's got to be the goat. This guy's supposed to be amazing. Like, no, they didn't even say anything about it. What am I saying? They just said this guy, random guy, Yasiel Puig, is getting pulled up from the Dodgers. I'm like, hmm, I'm gonna pick him up. Let's see what he's about. Literally, the guy became a beast, breakout player, stud, unbelievable, and now he has a he has a great MLB card against righties. Lefty's okay. Arm strength, you know Puig got the arm. Puig be throwing people out from right, left field, wherever. So Puig, great, great, great budget fielder. These are my top three right here. We got Puig for the golds. We're going first. We're going golds first. We got Puig, we got Ruth, and we got Otani. Those are my top three, hands down. Next, I fuck with Mitch Hager. He's not bad. Cruz, whoa, look at those batting stats. Oh my god. If you guys need a power hitter, pick up Cruz. Holy crap, that's insane, man. Wow, okay. So Nelson Cruz, that's very interesting right there. Very good fielding, very good arm strength. Slow as hell, though. Might not be a reliable outfielder, but he'll get the job done. Maybe a pitch hitter. Very good pitch hitter, Nelson Cruz. Okay. So, all right, let's go into the next one. Nick Barkakis is all right. Let's, he's all right. Contact, eh. Josh Reddick, eh. Nah, nah, nah. Avisel Garcia. Honestly, even, honestly, I feel like he's just going to have a breakout season. He's hitting fourth for the Rays, so his price should go up anyways. I've, I have him in fantasy. I really think he's going to break out. He, like, he showed signs of breaking out. Like, two years ago, he did amazing. This year, the next year, he had a, a, a month of where he just went off. And then he got hurt. He was, like, hurt the whole season. But I would keep an eye on this car. He might be gold in the first two weeks of this game. But, hold up. I spy with my little eye. Oh, okay. Jose Martinez. He's also a first baseman. He is very... I don't know why. Where is this? Where is it? Yeah, first baseman. Very good card. Great contact. 
Very, very underrated player. Could go up in value. Conforto, I'm a Mets fan. He got power, guys. This might be the year where he finally hits 40 home runs. The Mets have a great average lineup. I'm really, really, really liking this card. Awesome pitch hitter against righties. Highly recommend. Adam Jones, the vet. Eh, stats aren't that good. Gonna skip that. Costanzalo's looking very good. All, about 65, then 75 and up from there. That's very interesting. Very interesting card. Kind of slow. Decent. Gritschuk. All right, yo. This guy right here. I've been waiting for this guy to break out. And he literally he just... He's so inconsistent, man. He'll have a week where he hits four home runs, and the next week he'll get K'd up 20 times. Like, I don't understand. Let's go him. Wow. Looking at this card makes me super upset, man. Like, this card makes me so upset. Carlos Gonzalez. Like, man, I'm the biggest Cargo fan. I had him the year where he dropped 30 home runs in the month of August in fantasy. But, man, they're gonna they're just going to disrespect Cargo and give him no power. It's Carlos Gonzalez, man. I just find this this card disrespectful. This is trash. They, card's trash. Mazzara probably... Mazzara doesn't even have power. So, trash. Bunch of cards. Hunter Renfro, crazy power. I guess you... I don't really, I don't really like him. Piscotti, he's going up in value. He's like the one hitter or two hitter. Nimmo, I'm a Mets fan, but maybe. I don't know. If they have, where's Mini Vlad? Do they have Vlad Jr. in this game? Eric Thames could go up. I don't know. He's got some good power. That's a good budget card right there. If you got no stubs at all, pick up this Eric Thames card. Highly recommend. Look at this. That power. Could be very good. Very, very, very good pitch hitter. So that's a great card to look at. We got, who else? What, can I, what else can I show you guys? Colby Rasmus, man. He's good. Very good pitch hitter. Very, 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 very good pitch hitter. Right there. Uh, we got... What else we got? Uh, oh, Carlos... Oof. Oh, look at those stats. They're trash. He fell off a cliff. I'm trying to think of sleepers right here. Where's all the sleepers? Where's the mini Vlad? Jose Bautista got a little something. Dude, can someone find me? Oh, perfect. Okay, ready? A lefty. So you want a lefty that can bunt in the game. If you need speed on base, you put a, a bunt down the third base line. This guy's this guy's safe, yo. Promise that. Promise that. Safe every time. Austin Meadows could break out this year. Pay attention to that. He could go up to a silver in the first two weeks. Dude, but where? They don't have what? Oh, I'm in right field. What's Mini Vlad play? Someone let me know in the comments where Mini Vlad plays. But honestly, let's also just... Let's see what else is budget. Mitch Hanniger is not bad. But, wow, what happened to this? Let's see. What else is budget over here? I mean, if you're going to spend the extra 5K, Charlie Blackman is kind of crazy. He has awesome vision. One of the best contact hitters in the game. Perfect power against righties. Lefties, decent. You don't want to play him against lefties, but he has contact against lefties. So, I guess I would swing X with him. But, by far, my top three is Otani. I'm so... I'm, I'm honestly gay for him. He's literally so, I'm so, he's so good. I love him, man. Otani's batting stance is so nice. Highly, 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 highly recommend the card. Puig, awesome pitch hitter. He's my pitch hitter. Him, these two are my pitch hitters, but Otani's about to get the star because every time I pitch hit him, he hits a home run. I'm not even kidding. He's so good. Um, Babe Ruth, is. these are my top three. In order, I would say Otani at the top. I'm sorry. Otani at the top, Babe Ruth second, Puig third. Those are my top three. My top three silvers are, I would say, uh, okay, I would say my top three silvers are Abyssal, just because I feel like he's going to break out, Jose, Jose Martinez, and Conforto. Those are my top three silvers right there. Marquecas, yo, they, they kind of botched the stats. They gave him the contact. That's all he has, the vision. Good contact hitter. I'm a fan of Marquecas. He really broke out for the Braves. Took him a couple years to get back into it, but he's back, and yeah, he could turn a gold very fast. He was an outstanding player last year. I think he had 180 hits on the season. So yeah, very, very interesting player to watch. But my top three bronze cards, let's get into it. By far, my top three bronze cards are... Okay, Aaron Althair. I didn't even mention this card. His He could break out. Also a huge... I've been waiting for this guy to break out for so long. If you want to pick him up, just to hold on to him, he could have a breakout season. 
Very interesting card to watch. Steven Souza. Oh my god. This guy hits bombs, but like his average is he's inconsistent as hell. This is one of my second this is my second favorite bronze. And last but not least, uh Austin Meadows. Like he has to break out sometime, right? He's gotta break out, man. He's he's so due to break out, it's unbelievable. Watch this guy this season. I'm telling you, he's gonna break out. Like this is his season. And that's all I got for you guys today. I hope you guys enjoyed the video. More budget cards coming soon. Probably center. I would say center field is next. Okay, guys. Stay tuned for more budget videos. I hope you guys like and subscribe to your boy. Please, everyone, if you see this video, just drop anything in the comments. Questions. Anything. Anything at all. Any questions about fantasy baseball, fantasy basketball, basketball, baseball. I'll answer all your sports questions. Any sport questions. Your boy Bugs is here to add. Like, I'll give you any answers. I'm very good at all sports, fantasies, everything. So, please, guys, let me know. MLB, the tips, anything, guys. I'm here for you guys, and peace out, everyone.